I'm hearing reports out there that LeVar Ball stole $2.5 million from the Big Baller brand. If this is true, this is very disappointing. It's very disheartening. I cannot believe that LeVar Ball would do something like this. I hope it's not true because stealing from your children, stealing from a business that you and your children have started, that's not right. Like I said, I hope it's not true. If it is true, Lonzo Ball needs to just be done with the big baller brand. He should do his own thing. LeVar Ball just needs to step back. I think it's best that he should have his own business. Lonzo should have his own business. And LaMelo, in the future, should start his own business deals. I don't think them coming together and forming a business is a good idea. It just seems very chaotic. They should just separate, you know, and they can still be a family. But I don't know. I, I really believe this is true. Unfortunately, this sounds credible. We'll have to wait and see. But it's just looking bad. To take money from your children, like, I don't understand that. He should be happy that his children are willing to do business with him. And I'm pretty sure that if he were to stop doing things like this, his children will be more supportive of him. Now, I'm looking at this from a distance, and I'm noticing that Lonzo Ball is distancing himself. Speaking of distance, Lonzo Ball is distancing himself from his dad. So from my understanding, Lonzo Ball is not really part of the Big Baller brand. I think he's all but done. I hope that's true. I think he just needs to leave that alone, start his own business. He can still be close with his dad if he wants to be. I am concerned that the opposite will happen down the road if LeVar, if LeVar Ball keeps getting into son's business affairs. If he keeps saying things like his son is better than Steph Curry and putting all this great pressure on the son. I think his son will get tired of that and just be like, hey, I'm done. I think that LeVar Ball should just step back, stop being so financially involved in his son's business affairs. I just think he's doing more harm than good. Now, his youngest son, LaMelo, he's projected to be a number one overall pick. So, I hope that LeVar Ball does not mess him up financially. I hope he's not over-involved in his son's career. I think it's best for him to step back. Just step back and be a dad. That's all LeVar Ball should do at this point. I think that'll work well. But if he keeps getting involved in their financial affairs and if he's taking money when he's not supposed to, it could cause a rift between him and his children. And I would hate to see that happen. I really would. So, hopefully this is not true. Hopefully, LeVar Ball did not take this money. If he did take it, he'll probably get sued. And it can turn ugly. Money can divide families. It can divide friendships. So, uh, LeVar Ball needs to just take it easy. If anything, they can hire a business accountant or have somebody else run the business. Maybe that might be an idea. So if all of them are still involved, get some outside help, some legitimate outside help, not someone who has a criminal record of financially stealing. You know, don't hire people who are not experienced for the job. Hire somebody with expertise. So if that might help them. I think that'd be the best, but I, I, I just don't see LeVar doing this. He's one of those people, he feels like he's always right. It's either his way or the highway. I see this going bad. Hopefully that won't be the case. We'll just have to wait and see what happens. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. You should definitely subscribe to my channel. If you've not done so already, just press that subscribe button below this video. If you did that, I'd greatly appreciate it. And plus, you wouldn't miss out on any, and excuse me, you wouldn't miss out on any future content that I post. So you definitely want to subscribe. Thanks again for watching. Thanks for listening. I hope that all of you have a blessed, wonderful day.